Hey guys, Grassman here. As I said before, to please like and subscribe, feel free to leave a comment, move into the beginning. So, please subscribe, leave a like, leave a comment, and here's, your, here's the rest of the video. As always, we'll start with opening chests. Two of these same. Oh, never mind. Well, only one, because the next one needs some time. Also, as you can see, we finally ended up with another clan who's beating us by a lot, too. We should be able to win by t today or tomorrow, probably. But they just destroy. They'll be done by the end of today. So we're going to finish this challenge, and then we're going to use the go do these. So I did change these two decks. The um, Sparky and Giant Skeleton ones weren't great. So this one's a Fireball Bait. Point is use the Elixir Collector, the Barbs Bait, a Fireball, and then get Royal Hogs. The rest of the cards control. And this one's something I made myself. It's an Electro Giant because we just got him. Uh, Electro Giant Graveyard deck. It's missing. It's missing a tank killer. Hunter instead of Ice Wizard. That's what we're gonna do. May as well do it here too. Because it was just a giant in this deck before, but it was missing a tank killer. So I'll stick, I'll stick a hunter in there instead, and this should make it a lot better. Yeah, so we'll come back to this. We're going to finish the Electro Giant Draft Challenge. We get 10, I believe, if we get to the final reward, so I'm probably going to spend gems even to it. Oh, how does Infernal Dragon interact with the... Does as soon as it do damage, it'll get zapped? Okay, that's not a good thing, and I hope I get the Electro Giant. No, that means he has it. Ugh. This would be bad. I shouldn't have taken that card. Unless he, like, gave it to me. Don't go that way. Never go that way. The Expo would be really bad against it, so it's a really good counter to Expo. I do- I want- I want to try out that, um... Maybe we'll also try- well, at some point we'll also have to try out that, that um, other deck I made. The one where it just replaces, um... Freeze with fireball, log with whatever it was. And, um, instead of Royal Giant, I put in Electro Giant. Get more! Ah.
Ah, GG. Actually, yeah, let's do that right now. So, hang on. Um, let's try it. So, I did, I did this deck, and then I replaced it with this deck using Tornado and Fireball. And Electro Giant. So... I guess we'll try this in a normal battle. This is probably gonna go bad. I haven't tried this before. My Fireball and Tornado are also both underleveled. Like, severely underleveled. Main problem with the Electro Giant is it's just so expensive. It makes it just so easy for your opponent to play something to fight it. It's so easy for your just opponent to just rush you on the other side while you're busy with it. So he's just solo hog ridering. Does he have zap? I forget, do you have zap? How do you have my skirm? Okay. That's a Firecracker Mini Pekka. And anyway, yeah, I wanna know how the Inferno Dragon will react to this, to the uh, Electro Giant. I assume just like the Hunter, it's a horrible matchup and you should never use it. I guess we'll have a chance to see now. Dang it. Okay, so yeah, it does like... Oh, come on, why does that kill it? I'm expecting a hog. Yeah, and I'm gonna set up a electric giant. No, stop pushing him, you're making him go too fast. You jerks. Freeze makes him so... That worked somewhat. He does have zap, he does have freeze. Um, what am I watching for? No! Oh my god. I was- I didn't mean to put it there.
Oh my god, he was lining up for another... I think he was lining up for another zap. That, so, it's it's weak to freeze, but that could be a legitimate deck, especially if I upgrade my fireball and tornado. That actually, and that's, I think that's like the first battle I've won with a, with a deck that wasn't this in a long time. How's UFO going so quick? Oh, the other clan. Hang on. Okay. On to the next battle. We have two more here, and then we'll do the clan wars. Um, can probably be better. It'll distract it, plus the Mega Minion has to get too close. Um, no point in skeletons. The Royal Recruits are abnormally good at fighting. Four guys that only do medium damage, what you wouldn't expect from them to be that good. But there's just enough of them with enough health and enough damage that they just can. So Royal Recruits for 7, I believe, do counter it. Not totally. Tower does take a lot of damage. Not in the middle. What's Bozo's doing? Don't know if I can win this one. I do figure I'll have to play pit, um, play gems to finish this. Why did it go... Mm. No, stop targeting him! My god, you morons are all stu- Oh my god. Jeez, and then the, then the tower attacks it. Oh my god. There was nothing I could do, I had no tank here. I, I had no tank killer, there was no way I could get through it. His, his Electro Giant could just do too much damage. I also didn't really have a tank, I just had a bunch of glass cannons. Just a hundred gems. How much, how much is it? Is it, that, is it that good? It's 5,000 gold and 10 of those. Of course, the gold alone is worth it. Continue the challenge with three new lives, yeah. I would have said like 50 for that, it's a fair, fair redo. 100's a lot. There's the electric giant. Bud? Hello? Is he AFK? That'd be nice. Maybe he's going random. Say good 
left anyway. After the real test, is he AFK? No, he's not. He did, he was just letting it pick random. Ah, nice job there. Electro Giant is such a counter to is such um, a counter to Barbarian. What are they called? Suicide units aren't great against him because of course they suicide, but they're also not terrible because they don't really get the repercussion of the zap. The Hunter, because all of the shots count as getting hit. The Hunt Electro Giant, like. It's twice the cost, but it just handles it, plus it puts the strong guy on the field. It's practically worth it to just counter it. Because then your opponent's got to worry about countering it as well. Don't use a tank. Didn't your mother ever tell you not to use Elixir Golem to tank? What do you need, Giant? We have Electro Giant, we have Giant, we have Royal Giant. Now we have Noob Giant. What's this guy? I meant to put that one, across, one further across the bridge. Princess is quite good. It'll deal with minion horde, and it can't be um too destroyed by the electro giant. I got to there anyway, though. Heal spirit's really good with the electro giant. If it heals him up. He's got more. Oh, you know what would be a really good combo? Electro Giant, Heal Spirit, uh, he Healer. The Electro Giant and then the, um, Healer? The Battle Healer, that's right. It would be like the best combo. Because the Battle Healer just keeps healing him while he keeps stunning all the opponents. That's, I'm, I'm, I'm a genius, guys. Rocket is not a good counter. You can't just spell it, guys. Why do you... And with his slow attack speed, the tower ends up dealing more damage to itself. The debt tower ends up dealing more damage to itself than the Royal Giant does to it. Much more. If you can have the tower not attacking it, that's, that's probably a better idea. He didn't even 
bait up my barb barrel. I knew I had it. Why did you do that? not even baiting the bar barrel. What's he doing? He doesn't know I have the card, right? Or you just keep forgetting? What the heck was that? Dude's getting desperate. Should I make a battle healer heal spirit deck with the, with the electro giant? That's what we'll do next, because I do have some free time. Fight. Normally it's killed by the zap. Because it just the attack happens like twice as often. That it gets zapped rather than attack. Didn't even have another loss. Lemma two. Why do I have to pay a hundred still? I already paid my hundred. Let me keep playing. Game. So let me keep playing if I want to. Um I don't really need I don't really need this deck. I don't really need to have like any of these decks. Um Okay, so Electro Giant Battle Healer. Who needs an upgrade? I don't have the gold. Oh. Yeah, upgrade this guy. Level six. I thought epics were supposed to start not no legends start at nine. Oh jeez. Um I guess I do another two thousand gets eight. I needed at least ten to be able to use it in the arena. Six isn't like so it's it's rung up to thirteen now, but I think I needed a, like at least ten. It's currently only level eight. Oh yeah, look at the like example fight. It's cool that it like offsets the archers. It actually does the stack. Yeah, so look at this. As soon as it does any damage it gets sapped. That is the worst possible thing to use against it. Um, as well as Heal Spirit. I'm not great at making decks. This will be a good start, though. Do we do, like, a mirror clone? What what does fight a good? King Puffy. Mini P.E.K.K.A. fights it good, so how do we stop Mini P.E.K.K.A.? We use Witch Distract- we use Witch Distract it with Skeletons. That's how we stop me, Pekka. Um, so we need a small spell and a big spell. Barb Barrel, probably because it also provides the distraction to get them off the, giant, off the Electro Giant. So you'll be our small spell. Um, Tornado's a good big spell. Actually, having Fireball as well would be a good idea. So it's expensive now, so we want to do something with three or less. So by Elixir, we don't really have a... Any tank killer. Hunter is four. Could use archers. How well would this deck do? Put it through the deck thing in the app. Okay, hang on, guys. Okay, here we are. It's a check deck it had. Electro Giant Witch Battle Healer. Um, Archers and Heal Spirit. And Fireball Tornado Barb Barrel. Are they both epics? Barb Barrel and Tornado should be somewhere around here. Let me find it. You're probably all watching it right now and you're like seeing me screw up. There it is. Phone's getting a bit hot. Okay, and. That's eight. How do I check it? It's deck cards. Arena 13, yeah, deck cards. 
How do I... Hang on, I'm gonna figure this out. Okay, I found it. It's right down here at the bottom. 3.8, yep. Defense great, attack great. Versatility mediocre. Yeah, it's mediocre. You would struggle against some things, like maybe Mega Knight. But I always struggle against Mega Knight. Everything I have struggles against Mega Knight. Bad synergy. One warning. Why? I always tell you how how is the deck able to defend against various things, swarm tanks, certain units. Problems and warnings. Yet warning. No way of punishing your opponent for spending elixir. What? When your opponent plays high cost units, six or more in the back, you have to be able to punish him, preferably by attacking the other lane to not let him accumulate a big push. Right, some sort of punishment method. Ah, oh, yes, yeah, so what, what could we replace? If we went, we could take out Barb Barrel. Replace it with. Um. Hang on, let me fix this. Here, so instead of Barb, instead of Barb Barrel, what if we use? These guys don't work well. Problem is, I want something that, like... Because if I put these guys behind the Electro Giant, he'll stun them. He'll stun something, and then we'll attack these things. So I can't really put him behind the Electro Giant. <sighs> eh. Now check this one. Defense Mediocre. Right, because we took out Barb Barrel. So now it's got a weaker defense. Bad versatility and bad synergy. So it went from. So it's now mediocre, great, bad, and bad. So this was better. Great, great, mediocre, and bad. Yeah, it turned. It's a bad. It's a bad into a great. Or technically just defense up and versatility up. Okay, I don't, I don't really need to punish, of course. I've got Fireball to take care of whatever big push, and then I can counter push. Reload the game. Yeah, so this is this should be fine then. So this is a good, so this is an interesting deck, so we'll play, so next time, I'll probably just do my wars on my own, um, next time we'll probably play around with this deck a bit, maybe this one, this guy needs 20,000, and this thing needs 50,000, so I need a bit of gold as well, yeah, so we'll play with these next time, this is fairly under leveled though, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 11, 11, so maybe I can get my clan mates to play with me. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Remember, if you enjoy my content, feel free to like and, to fe feel free to like and subscribe. Blah. Um, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.